Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. My name is Gabriela and today we have something very special for you. We are in Celebration, Florida in one of the most beautiful cities, not just in Central Florida, but also in all of the United States. This community is known for being at just a few minutes from the magic of Walt Disney World. And of course, it just has that historic charm that you can most definitely take advantage of. Not just that, these are also new homes. So you'll have that combination of historic, but also a modern property. Now the community we have today is most definitely impressive, but the property is even more. This home features four bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms, and 3,444 square feet. Without further ado, let's take a look. Now, welcome to what could be your future home. This property most definitely very elegant, but the first thing we're gonna notice is two things, the flooring and the ceilings. In this particular case, in the main foyer, main entrance, and main areas of the home, you're gonna find tile throughout the entire home. This is kind of like a wood-looking tile as well, but it gives it that you know farm-style home, but still very modern as well. In this case, you have ceilings around 10 feet in some of the areas. In the social areas, it's gonna be a little bit more. It's gonna be around the 11 to 12 feet in terms of height, but this most definitely brings a lot of elegance into the home. Now we're gonna start right ahead with my left side. We have our half bathroom here on the main entrance of the home. This is perfect. So when you have guests over, you know that they don't have to be going to your bedroom at night, right? And just going through your personal things just to go to the bathroom. Perfect for your guests to, you know, feel comfortable over here. Before we continue with the first bedroom, I do wanna mention the dining room space. It's kind of rare these days to see a designated space for a dining area. And this one definitely looks very formal. So you can most definitely have a lot of fun over here decorating and just giving your guests a very proper dinner. And you can already just see yourself just creating amazing memories in this space. And you can most definitely have a lot of fun in this area when you of course make it your own. I also do appreciate that there's two windows on the side of the home bringing in a lot of beautiful natural light. Now, right across from the living room space, there's the first bedroom. This is always important to have bedrooms on the first floor. Not everyone can actually go to the second floor. This one also with an ensuite. This particular bedroom, or actually all the bedrooms in this property have carpet. It's pretty standard with most new construction homes. This also depends which builder is right, the one that you like. And also depends on the stage of the home when you actually go under contract that you can always uh, change it or not, just depending, like I said, just depends on the builder. Now, continuing with the bedroom, very beautiful bedroom, plenty of space for you to decorate. You have about a queen size bed over here with plenty of room for you to maybe add extra seating dressers. You have two windows with view of the front of the home of the front porch. So it's most definitely very elegant, kind of that traditional historic home feel. In this case, you have a walk-in closet over here, shelving also installed. And to my right side, you have this door, which leads to the bathroom. This bathroom, most definitely very elegant. You have kind of like a gray ceramic towel. In the case of the vanity, you have quartz in the vanity. Very beautiful quartz as well, most definitely in terms of quality. This builder most definitely knows what they're doing. Um, you have white cabinets as well. You have your toilet and right behind you, you have your tub with your ceramic towels, subway style towel all the way up, which is always very, very elegant. Now, as we step out of this bedroom, we're gonna step back in into the main hallway. And I definitely love when properties have this traditional long hallway, just so you have, you know, you can appreciate an open concept, but when you open the front door, it's not just, you know, hey, kitchen. You have most definitely a very traditional separated home with a modern twist. Now, welcome to what would be your social areas of your home. We're gonna start right ahead actually with the kitchens because this kitchen or any kitchen of any home is my favorite, but this one is most definitely a showstopper. The quartz in this kitchen most definitely just screams elegance. There's a lot of detail in the stone itself. So you know that this is a stone that was picked specifically for this home to make sure that it ties the elegance of the home all together. Most definitely a long island that features around, a space for around four to six adults, I would probably say over here. If you definitely play around with it properly, you can um, or keep it just how they have it around four just to give everyone space. But if you have kids, this is always eight plus because you can turn this into like a breakfast area. 
In terms of the island, you do have a sink on the island as well. Very beautiful and modern. Kind of has that like urban look. As you have the ceramic sink and you have some gold features in some of the appliances and features throughout the home as well, which always modernize the property. In terms of the island, you do still have your dishwasher on the side of the island and some extra cabinet space. Right behind me, we're gonna have this other section where we're gonna have plenty of countertop space as well. The beautiful quartz continues along. You do have a cooktop with gas in this community, which is always a bonus. It would just taste much better with gas anyways, but you guys can tell me if that's right or not. Um, in terms of the vent, you do also have your vent included, very modern and elegant as well. A lot of cabinet space for you to play around. All the cabinets are extra large as well, and you do have crown molding, finishing up the kitchen and tying everything up together. And right adjacent to everything, you have this extra space where you have most definitely a lot of room to maybe add some coffee machines, air fryers, whatever you want to have, and bring your fridge as well. You do have your oven and your microwave already included right over here. Here. Next thing we have is our pantry. Pantry is very nice and it's actually pretty much a walk-in closet. Most definitely a lot of space for you to bring a lot of food, especially if you have kids. This is always a plus, you know, having a comfortable pantry. Right in front of the pantry, we have what would be your two-car garage with a tandem. So in theory, it is a three-car garage as you can fit a full vehicle in the tandem. But this is most definitely a very, very ample space. Another feature about this home is that you do have the outlets for electric vehicles, which is always something really important, especially as we go into the future, right? And more of us are actually getting electric vehicles. In terms of also what you have in the garage, you have your two panels for the home, and you do have your access to the attic right through here. Your garage or opener is also available over here. Now, let's go back inside. Now finishing with the pantry garage, heading once again into the kitchen area, we're gonna go and check out this other space. This would be kind of like your day-to-day -day, um, eating area, pretty much like your breakfast areas or some of a separate dining room area. You could always close this up and turn it into an extra bedroom or maybe into an office if you would like, but I would definitely say it's most definitely very comfortable for you to have most definitely a comfortable table over here, have your guest over here during your day to day. And of course, most definitely enjoy the fact that you have a multiple windows also in this section to take advantage of the space, a lot of counter room as well. So you can most definitely even turn this into like a wine bar up to you, right? Now, right across, we have the last space in the social areas. You have your living room space. Most definitely very elegant, a lot of room for you to play around. The property is most definitely an open concept style, but you most definitely still have segmented areas that make it easy for decoration and organizing the property once you move in. Most definitely you can add your 100 inch TV, maybe bigger, up to you. Most definitely add some rugs, some mats, just to segment out the space a little bit better. And I do also appreciate the fact that you have the beautiful sliding doors that lead to your backyard. A fun feature about this property is the fact that is actually already set up for a pool. So if you wanted to add a pool, the ground is already leveled and you can most definitely just do that with your preferred contractor that builds pools in this area. We can always connect you with the best builders in the area, but always a plus when you have these beautiful grand doors that slide all the way through, just especially during the holiday season, right? You know that the weather gets really nice here in Florida. You can most definitely take advantage of opening both sides and just letting the cross air freshen up the space. Now, we're pretty much done with the social areas. Let's go check out the primary suite. Tucked away in a corner of the home, we have a few things. Besides the master suite, you do have also your laundry room. Always a bonus, I would say, when the master suite and the walk-in closet are actually nearby the laundry as you're, you know, in your day-to-day -day life, it's just easier just to throw things in here, right? And just keep the laundry, you know, busy all the time. Especially if you have kids, it's always a plus. You can keep an eye on the loads. This particular property does include your sink and quartz as well with the white cabinets. This is where you're gonna bring your washer dryer with already the hooks included. And you have extra cabinet space with crown molding on top as well, giving you a lot more storage space as well. But now, the room you most definitely want to see, the primary bedroom. Before we head into the main area, I do want to show you the walk-in closet that is very close to the main entrance of the room. This walk-in closet is most definitely just perfect in terms of space. I am so jealous that whoever's going to buy this has this beautiful closet. Also another feature that we want to talk about is the shelving that the builder is also including. This is actually 
You know, I haven't seen this in a while. Usually they'll do like their traditional metal rods. And this most definitely not just looks elegant, but also it's very different. It also gives you use of the top of all the shelves. Now, let's go check out the main room itself. Most definitely a beautiful bedroom. I do also appreciate that it has tracing ceilings all throughout, just giving you extra height into the bedroom, just making it look much more open and fresh and just, just elegant overall. You do still have the carpet standard in this bedroom. You do have a few windows and even access to your backyard. So whenever you add that pool, it's gonna be very easy to, you know, just access over there. Over here, you have pre-wire for your TV. You, they do have a dresser over here. But right behind it, you have the pre-wires for everything. And of course, most definitely a space where you can have your king size bed with your big frame and just have a lot of fun decorating as well. Now, let's go check out the bathroom. This bathroom is most definitely very elegant. Just kind of gives you that vibe that you're in a resort. It just gives you that energy that you can just come here, relax, and just refresh and a crazy day at work you have glass over here in your shower not necessarily a door but you can most definitely have that elegant open shower feel you have three windows right up there just opening up and freshening up the area you have tile all the way up in the gray color and tile also kind of like a cream color in the bottom in terms of the vanity you have a dual vanity sink with drawers as well and plenty of cabinets as well in the quartz in terms of the stone and another few things we want to mention about the bathroom is the fact that you have extra linen closets over here maybe give this one for whoever has these clothes it could be him it could be her i'll let you guys decide i'm gonna stop saying his and hers so you can guys of course make that decision for yourselves over here you have the last thing in this bathroom which is your toilet room in this case with a private door private light private vent for those private moments. Now guys, we're gonna go upstairs, check out the bedrooms and finish over with this tour. Now, welcome to the second floor. Very elegant stairway with wood also in the stairs. So it gives you, you know, that relief of not having carpet in the main area of the second floor. You have a loft area up here where you can most definitely maybe add a mirror room, have a little fun decorating, maybe a game room or a man cave, whatever you guys want to do up here. In this case, the particular loft actually has a few windows as well, so you can most definitely have still a lot of open feel into the area. This stair railing, very elegant as well, with the wood paneling as well, very elegant. And the first thing we're gonna see over here to the left is the first bedroom. And something I love about this bedroom and something kind of rare with builders is that they already even have kind of like a book corner over here. I personally would have so much fun over here just reading some fun books, whatever you guys read. Just over here, relax, maybe add some cushioning and just enjoy the view of the exterior. You do have a bedroom that most definitely fits a queen size bed. You have your traditional closet with French doors. So most definitely very elegant as well. Much better than the slidings, right? You do still have shelving also installed. Now finishing with the bedroom we were just in, we're gonna step back in into the hallway as we still have a few things to see. First door over there was AC. This door over here is the linen closet over here in the hallway. You can always turn it into a game room closet. Uh, just do with the area as you please. Then we have kind of like a Jack and Jill style bathroom where the main areas of the loft and the second floor can use it. But also it actually has private entrance into the other bedroom. Let's actually go in into the bathroom as we do still have a few things to see in here. I'm gonna close this door so you guys can take a look at the space. You have a separate section of the bathroom that has the tub, shower, and your toilet. Then we, of course, in this main area have the dual vanity sink with quartz and the white cabinetry as well. As we exit from the bathroom through the entrance that will lead into the other bedroom, this bedroom is towards the front of the home. You do have a lot of wonderful windows also. I love that they have a lot of edges as well. So you can most definitely use this to decorate as well. You do have a tandem in this corner. So maybe if you have kids, you can always maybe set a desk over here, add maybe a bed over around here, queen size bed. Most definitely have a lot of fun decorating. And another feature about this bedroom that I do appreciate is that it has a walk-in closet 
also with all of your shelving installed when the builders include all the shelving in most FA not just saves you in terms of time but also in terms of spending extra once you move in now guys we're pretty much done with the interior let's go check out the lanai and finish with this tour Let's open in these sliding doors, guys, because I want to show off how amazing this home looks all opened up and just, you know, perfect, like I mentioned, for those holiday seasons where you most definitely want to, you know, allow that cross air into the home. And when you add that pool, this is going to be amazing, most definitely a showstopper. Now, welcome to the Lanai. Most definitely a gorgeous space over in this home with you have the bricks in the flooring that just definitely gives it that like historic look into the property. Your cover than I already has a lot of features that you can most definitely add on, right? Maybe add some extra lights all throughout. You do have the pre-wires for the fans also included. And like I mentioned, you most definitely have a wonderful lot in this particular case with no neighbors in the back. So you can most definitely build that pool and know that you're going to have a lot of privacy. But now guys, we're pretty much done with this tour. I really do hope you guys enjoyed. Let's go back inside and talk about the numbers, the location and everything this builder has to offer. Let's go. Thank you so much guys for making it to this segment of the video where we're going to talk about all the details on the home and of course what you want to know, the price on this property. Now what we have here today is something very special. Like I mentioned, it's not just the property but it's also the location. It's probably one of the most prestigious locations in all of Orlando, Florida. Now let's start with what you want to know which is the asking price on a property just like this one. This property has a price of $1,450,000. This property features four bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms, and 3,444 square feet in Celebration, Florida. Celebration is most definitely known for having all the convenience of being just a few minutes from Walt Disney theme parks. The downtown of Orlando is just a few minutes away. And you have most definitely also the ability to be a part of a community that is very rare to find these days. A community that is small, it's charming, it has that historic look, but you're actually still able to buy a new construction home. So you know that you're not just gonna be the new owner of the home, you're going to be a part of a community that is not just beautiful, but most definitely very welcoming. The schools in the area, Celebration High School and Elementary and Middle School are all probably some of the best rated schools in the area as well. So your kids are gonna most definitely have some great education when you're living in this area. But not just that, all of the communities, not just this one, are most definitely very pedestrian friendly, very family friendly. So you know that you're gonna be seeing a lot of kids running around, most definitely biking around. This is most definitely also important to mention. There is also a historic downtown for Celebration. But you can most definitely go over there drive around, have food, have wine, go to the diners, check out some of the shops. Most definitely very similar to actually the Winter Park Park Avenue. Um, that same historic look where you have the brick roads and the beautiful small charming stores with the small charming restaurants as well. There's always a lot of events going on in the historic downtown as well. Especially during the holiday season, Celebration is probably one of the most renowned Christmas segments to come and visit over here in Orlando. For one of the cities that everyone just says, hey, you just have to go check out the lights over in Celebration. I even myself during the holiday season come over here, check out some of the lights, interact with the locals, of course, check out some of the restaurants and most definitely enjoy the beautiful decoration that this beautiful town has to offer. Not just that, but you can most definitely drive around and enjoy the view of beautiful, beautiful homes. In order to also be part of this community, you do have to keep in mind that there are HOA and CBD fees to this particular neighborhood. This is also why the area is so prestigious and also why it's always so clean. And the schools and everything are always being remodeled and developed and just, you know, getting the best of the best is because, of course, you have those CBD fees that help, of course, develop the district entirely. Now let's start with the HOA. The HOA for this specific section of celebration is $292 quarterly, which just covers a lot of things, not just, of course, the maintenance of the community, but also maintenance around the properties, especially our front of the homes. Now in terms of CDD, you do have a CDD fee of $2,662 a year. This is around $220 a month. This will also, between the CDD and the HOA, give you access to five pools around celebration. They're all luxury and, of course, just very, very elaborate pools with splash pads and much, much more. You, of course, do have hiking trails and play parks and 
small and large dog play parks as well. You also do have hiking areas, you have fitness centers, around two fitness centers actually, and you even have yoga lawns where you can most definitely enjoy a lot of activities as this community, like I mentioned, has a lot going on all the time. Thank you so much guys for making it to this section of the video. I do appreciate your time and I really do hope you enjoyed today's tour. I usually don't really post properties like this one in our channel, but I definitely want to do something very special for the end of the year. Celebration is like I mentioned, one of the most amazing cities that Orlando has to offer, not just to live here, but you can always come visit and take a look at the beautiful homes being built in the area, but it's also one of the few new constructions in the region. So you can most definitely take advantage of in a opportunity just like this one not just to live in it but maybe that's an investment as well thank you so much most definitely check out our instagram guys where we're always active over there checking out some of our day-to-day -day deals that maybe i find it's probably the easiest way to find out what's going on in the market you can also meet myself in my day-to-day -day life you can also follow my team social media as well some of my team members are always interacting in social media as well you'll also be able to meet them and see who could potentially be helping you finding your next dream home i appreciate you guys' time and i'll see you guys next time